Hi guys, welcome back and welcome if you're new to my channel. My name is Tiffany. In today's video, I am changing out my fall decorations for my Christmas decorations. In my fall tour video, I got several questions asking me um, how do I organize my decorations? Where do I store everything? So in today's video, I'm going to show you guys how I store it, how I decorate. Um, I have a cleaning to do. I have a lot of decorations from last year. So I'm going to go through those um, and see what I have before I run to the store and pick up a few uh, new things to add to those old decorations. Let's get into it. So I've already started in the bedroom. I removed my um, white sheets that I had on here and just added um, some of these red and black plaid. I did not show you guys making up the bed because there is no graceful way in making up this bed. And for now, I just kind of threw my pillows to the side. I haven't decided on um, how I'm going to actually lay them out. But by the end of the video, I will know. So I am going to go ahead and take some of the, again, the fall decorations um, out of here. If you have not seen that video, I will link it in the info tab above. Um, so you can check it out. So I'm going to kind of remove this here. And then in my bathroom, I'm only going to change out that reef thing. So yeah, so I'm going to go ahead and get started. And as you see, I still have um, my decorations, my fall decorations set up here. I'm going to put everything on the table here um, and then pull out all of my Christmas decorations and kind of look through those. Okay, so I pulled out all of my Christmas decorations um, and I'm going to go through those and kind of see what I have and kind of get an idea of where I'm going to put everything. Um, I want to change it up from last year. And if I can find some photos, I will insert my decorations from last year. Yep. So that's it. So actually, before I um, pull those out, remove some of my fall decorations and put them on the table because I'm going to reuse those baskets. So I have all of my uh, fall decorations here on the table. I'm going to start with this wreath here. I'm going to cut the wire off of it. And it's just ho holding the um, leaves in place on this ring. I'm going to just cut those off. Disassemble the wreath. And then I'm going to put all the components of this wreath in one um, sandwich bag. So that whenever I need it again or need it for next year, um, it'll be easy for me to find. And someone asked me in the comments, where did I get this wreath from? Um, I made this. I've been making wreaths, oh God, for over a decade now. So it cost me maybe about $3 to make this wreath. All of this um, floral was a couple of dollars. And then this ring was just a dollar. Try not to tear up the little balls. But I can always glue those back on.
going to reuse these pine cones, so I'm not going to stir those away, but I am going to take out everything um, that is orange. have wires in them so you can just bend them in half um, all I have left are just the smaller bags so I'm just going to write on here mason jar so that I remember that these came out of the mason jar off the table so that I have room to kind of spread out my um, Christmas decorations I am going to reuse um, I know for sure one of these baskets I'm not sure if I'm going to reuse one um, both of them or not but I am going to reuse these pine cones so I just removed all of the orange um, pumpkins and different um, little decorations from the basket so this is everything from last year I'm trying to think what I'm going to do with this I'm not sure and I'm thinking about putting this on my bed um, last year it went here but I think I may add it to my bed we'll see okay. All right, let's see what we have my Christmas lights from last year I had them um, above the front windshield Here's the star from my tree last year. And I gave my tree away that I have last year. Um, so I won't be putting that up again, of course. All right, so that looks like everything that I have. Um, this is my candy dish. I need to get some peppermint. I'm going to go to Dollar Tree next. And I had this sign here. Okay, so that's it. Dear God, give me the strength to go in this store and not lose my mind. Help me, Lord. Help me. Look where I'm at, guys. Oh my God, Hobby Lobby. My weakness. Hobby Lobby and Target. My favorite home decor stores. <sighs> okay, let's do this. So I am replacing my Christmas tree from last year. I need something smaller and I'm thinking about getting one of these trees here. And I don't know if I want this one here or if I want to go with this one. Uh, let's 
decisions, decisions. So I found a different tree and I'm gonna get this one here. And I don't know which tree skirt. I like this one. Uh, and the red and white is different. I think I'm gonna go for this one here. Does that match, guys? And then I have the star from last year. They have this from last year, which was my snowflakes. There's a few of the skirts. Look how cute that colorful skirt is. Love it. Love it, love it, love it. I love all this color. Okay, let me get off this aisle and see what else I can find. And I think I'm gonna reuse the stocking that I had from last year. But I'm gonna just look through here to see if there's any stockings that kind of jump out at me. I like these plain ones. Look at every type of hook that you can think of, but I am going to purchase mines from the Dollar Tree for just a buck. I'm not sure how much these are, but I know they're more than a dollar. And all the string garlands. So pretty. I have this one here from last year. It makes lots of noise. <laughs> and I think I'm going to hang it this year as well and then just add some greenery because I like this one here. Yeah, so as you see, this one here is just pine cones. Um, kind of a rustic look. And that's what my Christmas theme was last year. So I'm going to just add some green. Just a little green. I like the red balls on this one here. Mm -hmm. Love this rustic. I'm gonna add some color this year. The red is the pop of color. God, look at these ornaments. How cute are those? This matches my uh, that matches my little skirt. Hmm. What could I do with these? Nothing. I'm not paying that price. How cute, how cute. How cute. Oh, I love that red truck. these little houses but I don't have anywhere to put it how cute are they I like those red bales too
So now I am going to start decorating my two-tier tray. This is going to go in the kitchen. So I'm just going to put some of my favorite things on it, um, like my favorite coffee mug. I got this last year from Hobby Lobby. It says single all the way. I thought it would be fun and just a great pop of color. And then I'm going to use my little bowl here. And then I have this guy that I'm going to put on the side. And then I have trees. I got these from Walmart. And I'm going to use some of my snowflakes from last year and just kind of put those in. And I'm going to see how this looks. Um, for my Those are snowflake marshmallows.
snowman is all around town Watch out the rain, these are falling down We stay up waiting for Santa tonight He climbs down the chimney at the speed of light While we're dancing around the Christmas tree Hugging and kissing just you and me stop the video for just a second um, I am losing daylight so I am going to continue this video tomorrow it is almost five o'clock I've been going at this I want to say about six or seven hours now um, because I am cleaning and doing a few other things um, as I decorate so I am going to pick back up um, in the morning so I didn't finish um, my bed and I'm getting ready to hang some garland let me flip the camera around for just a second this um, garland here that I need to put together it's just um, there's several pieces and so I want to make one long um, piece to go across the top of my uh, cabinets there so yeah I am going to work on that tonight I may show a little bit of footage from this but again I'm losing daylight so I will pick up on tomorrow so I hope you guys are enjoying the video so far I have had so much fun decorating and so I can't wait to show you guys what it looked like um, once I have everything um, together yeah so yeah so I'm going to end this for now um, I may show just a little bit of me putting the garland together I'm not sure yet but I'm hungry and I need to get something to eat and I need to clean up my mess yeah. so those are two pieces that I put together and then I have these hooks so I'm going to use some Gorilla Tape um, and stick them on the wall above my bed two-sided Gorilla Tape to put on the back side of my hooks instead of using the tape that came with it because I want to make sure that it sticks. I hope it sticks. I'm almost done I have the garland hung um, above my cabinets now I am going to work on this side and then put my mirror back on the wall and then I think that's it I just realized I got my curtain on backwards I am NOT fixing that anyways so yeah I'm gonna put up the last strip of garland right across there 
Woohoo! I'm almost done. Okay, so this is it for tonight. I got the other um, garland hung and I need to fix that. And that. So I'll just add some more pieces to it tomorrow. And then I'm debating if I want to turn this curtain around or not. I don't know. Yep. And then I still need to finish working on my bed. So I am not done with that. So yep. It's the kitchen. Um, and then I don't know where I'm going to put my candle. I think I'm going to burn it for a while before I actually put it away. I think I'm going to leave both of these pillows out. I'm not sure if I'm going to put that Noel pillow on my bed or not. But I'm going to sleep on it and then just think about it tomorrow. I'm going to miss this uh this view. I head out. Oh, a fly just came in here. I head out in a couple of days. So I'm going to miss this view of the mountains. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. Okay guys, so that's it for tonight. I will pick back up in the morning and finish um, decorating and then show you guys what everything looks like. All right, see you in the morning. Bye. Good morning guys, I'm back. It's the next day. Um, I am going to make up my bed. I need to fix the garland up here is sagging, so I'm going to adjust that. I have some Christmas lights here. Um, I'm not sure where I'm going to put them, um, so I'm still trying to figure that out. So it may not make it in this video because I don't know where I want to put my lights. I have, let me turn it on. Uh, I have some twinkle lights up here. Um, this I've had up here since... Um, that I've had up here for over a year now. So I'm trying to debate if I'm just going to leave those lights up or add these lights. So I don't know. I don't know. And then I'm going to put away my fall decorations and then show you guys what everything looks like. So let's go. I'm so sleepy. I am tired. But let's get into it before it get hot because I think he's supposed to get up to 80 80 something today, so yeah, let's get into it. I've been staring at this back wall for um, about an hour now, and I feel like I need to add something here. Um, that's where my dream catcher was. It was kind of hanging down, so I'm th trying to debate if I'm going to add some pine cones or if I should add this um, here and kind of have it hanging down. Hmm. And then I also have um, this little sign here, but I think it's too small, like, yeah, for that space. Um, and then I have my pine cone wreath. So I was thinking about plucking the pine cones off of this. If I don't hang this above the cab area, that's the driver and front seat, the back of it. Um, I was thinking about plucking the pine cones off of that. And I have these pine cones, these smaller ones, but I think they're too little. <laughs> but I feel like I need something. Something in that space. And I don't know about this since that curtain is white and then this is white here. But I think some pine cones would really pop. <laughs> okay, I'm going to give it some more thought. All right. I painted... Um, the snowman the other night I painted the snowman and I'm trying to think of where to put it I have this space here Let's see I have this space here on the wall so I was thinking about putting him there decisions decisions I don't know guys I really like how this um, lantern turned out I'm loving it I'm loving it I'm loving it I'm loving it
so I have all of my um, decorations bagged up my fall decorations and my regular everyday decorations I am going to store them in the overhead um, storage bin this is my overhead storage bin I have some extra curtains in there um, some crafting supplies so this is where I'm going to put my decorations I'm putting in my fall decorations first so you can see I have the first bag okay I was waiting for it to zoom in so I have the first bag in so now I'm going to add in my fall blankets and then my everyday decorations because I will need those again right after Christmas so I need for those things to be um, easily accessible okay so I have my fall decorations all put away and then the decorations that I'm going to need right after Christmas is um, up front so it'll be easy for me to grab those and then I have extra space in front of that orange blanket where I keep all of my um, baseball caps and different hats. So I have a few more things to decorate. I have um, my black wire basket that I think I'm going to place in the bathroom and just put some pine cones in it. Um, if I don't use it then of course I just put it up in the added to the storage space up above. I have a ton of room up there. Um, trying to think what else and then again I'm still thinking about that spot here above the bed what I'm going to do with that space I'm really thinking about some pine cones yeah okay all right I'm going to finish cleaning and um, do the final touches on my decorations and if I add anything else um, after this video I would just insert some pictures on the end or um, include them in my Instagram stories and then I have this um, garland Get this out the way. I have this garland that I am going to hang above the cab area which is where the driver and uh, passenger seats are and then I have these hooks here that I got from the Dollar Tree um, I hope you really can't see this clear hooks but I'm gonna try to camouflage it um, with the decorations that's on here and then I am going to add this I'm going to add this to the middle of this garland let's see how that's going to look okay guys how is that looking you can see the I'm going to have to camouflage it some because I can really see the clear hook where is it at on this one here yeah okay but unless you're just staring at it you really don't see it so I think that turned out pretty good I'm gonna work with the um, ornaments and see if I can kind of camouflage it a bit I think I can I think I can turned out pretty good yep now I'm going to work on this basket. And I think this is all the pine cones that I have left. And I'm not leaving. I'm not going to any stores for a couple of days. So I might just have to show you guys what it looks like. Insert some pictures on the end. Because I don't have any more pine cones. Okay. All right. Okay guys, so that completes my Christmas decoration video. I am going to clean up um, my mess and then I will just insert some pictures on the end. I've already done a tour video, so I'm not gonna do another tour video. I'll just insert some pictures of how everything turned out. So as always, thank you so much for watching my videos. I appreciate your support and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.